What's up YouTube, it's your boy Nash here, welcome back to the channel, and today, this is the first time ever I've ever done this on, on my channel, but I have some Yu-Gi-Oh! news for you guys. Now this is part, now, now this is the band list that I found out on Facebook just now, and this is, um, and it's the brand, it's the brand new band list, effective as of September 17th of this year, so I just want to like really quick go over, um, the cards that have been added to the ban list and whatnot. So, first off, we have we actually have uh, some Sara Lotus. So, some Sara Lotus has been banned um, because it was you because back back in the day it was used in so many different um, so so many different uh, uh, Ubel decks, and it's been and um, I'm I'm actually surprised about that. Um, another card that I'm that I'm surprised about is uh, is Nightmare Goblin. It's one of the one of the one of the nightmare link monsters. Um, I don't know much much about that, but I'm uh, yeah, that's kind of weird. And they they also banned MX Saber Invoker, which is very very odd because it bas because it basically I think it basically lets you special summon monsters from your hand or something like that. So, but yeah, and so, and so now we actually move on to the limited list, which means um, which means the um, which means, uh, the format is, is limited to one. Um, so right, so first off, we ha we actually have A Assault Core, which is, um, obviously, which, which honestly, 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 my opinion, it, it makes sense, because a lot of people were, were, were using three of them, and, um, it got, like, I guess, um, I guess it basically brings back, bring, brings out your other monsters. I guess I'm not, I'm, I'm not familiar. I'm, I'm, I'm not too familiar with the ABC core, um, and then Stratos. Of all cards, they finally brought back Stratos after so many years. I am very, very surprised about that because um, with Stratos, it was banned for so many years. I'm surprised they actually brought brought that back. It was kind of, that's kind of a shocker to me. And then also Morphing Jar, which is pretty funny. It's funny that they bring back Morphing Jar, but um, because um, it's it was so weird. It's weird that they brought that they brought that they brought Morphing Jar back because um, because they uh, because Morphing Jar was was banned banned for so many so many years because because a lot of people were running were running literally at least two or three of them. And, um, and it's funny because, um, more because with Morphing Jar, they basically what they be basically for those who don't know, um, for, for those who don't know, Morphing Jar basically when it's, when it's destroyed, wild face down. Both players discard their entire hand and, and they draw five cards. So this card would be perfect in many different Dark World decks. So it's pr pretty cool. And then also Heavy Metal Foes Electromite, which is one of the, which is one of the newer one of the Heavy Metal Fo which is one of the the Metal Foes uh, support, which is very straight, which is um, pretty interesting. And Cypher and Lord Omega is also on the limited list as well. And also, they finally brought back Evil Swarm Exiton Knight, which I might, um, in which I'm, th in which I was thinking about putting this in my, in my Ubel's uh, Dark World deck, update my updated deck. But um, honestly, I just didn't really. Honestly, I, I don't think so. Um, and then, um, and then also, and then so we move on to the spell. So a hero lives has been. Has been limited to one. Originally, it was limit. It was semi-limited to two, but it bet went up to one. And then card destruction as well, which would again works great with Dark World. So, card card destruction. Um, again, everybody's gonna be using it. They're gonna go. It, it's gonna be used against um, against so many different decks. Obviously, Dark World's one. Uh, Sky uh, Sky Strikers and Trick Stars as well. And then also, uh, uh what's this one called? Sky Striker Mecha Hornet Drones. So it's one of the new the new Sky Striker cards that was released in um, Dark Saviors. Um, that's pretty cool. That's pretty pretty interesting. Um, 
I never, I never would have imagined that they would do that. And super polymerization. For those, who, for those who don't know, super polymerization is finally back. Um, I'm surprised about that because with that, again, these cards are. I'm so surprised that they brought that they that they switched it up. Because with super polymerization, basically all you're doing is like fusing your monster with your opponent's. So that's pretty interesting. Um, I know that it was used in in uh, Cyber Dragon mirror matches and also Dark Magician mirror uh, mirror matches as well. So I mean, we'll see. We'll we'll see what happens in the in future tournaments. And then, are you guys? So we move on to the semi limited, which means it is uh, with which means only, you're only allowed two. And um, and so Cosmo Dark Destroyer. Uh, it it originally it was limited to one, but now it's now now at two, um, and then uh, called by the grave. That's that's a new one. Um, I guess that bring that brings back one of your monsters or something like that. I'm not sure. And then limited removal. Finally, yes, limited removal is now up to two, which is really good for <coughs> for um for different cyber dragon monsters. For, sorry, for so different cyber dragon decks. And then Scapego, which um, makes sense because uh, Scapego, right now with my Ubel's Dark World, which I'm almost done with, um, I actually have um, I'm I'm actually running o only two of those, so it, so it makes and then um, it makes sense, and then also Terraform it as well, uh, which is the field spell searcher for you. So yeah, if anyone out there is using is using decks with field spells, yeah, that kind of destroys the deck. And then, and so we move on to uh, cards that are no longer on the list, meaning you are actually allowed, um, meaning you're allowed to use a whole playset. And so I never, I never would imagine that I never would have imagined this. So for the monsters, we have. Apocryphal Apoc Towers. Um, originally, it was semi limited, and then yes, wow. Okay, so any so to anyone out there who is using Destiny Heroes, this commander is back. For those who don't know, uh, basically, if it's discarded from if it's discarded from the hand to the grave, the moment you special summon it from your grave, you can draw two cards. That literally, that wow. Oh my god, that is insane. That's pretty awesome. And then Burial from a Different Dimension, um, which was uh, semi-limited, but now it's back on the format of 3. And then also Ring of Destruction. So, yeah, so, so, so yeah, that is the uh, the new ban list. Um, everything else is pretty much the same. Um, obviously, Cyber Jar, Cyber Stein, uh, Level Eater, uh, Max C, uh, uh, Band... Um, uh, some of, some of the, of the, the Dragon Rulers, uh, Construct is banned still, uh, Agent Fairy Dragon is still banned, Lavalval Chain is banned, obviously, uh, number 16, you know, so, post in the comments below, let me know what you guys think about, about the new ban list, because honestly, this is like, one of the most interesting ban lists now we have ever had in the last few years. Um, so again, post in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think. And yeah, I I mean when I saw this, I had to post I had to post the video. So I I had to. So um, hope you guys enjoy. Post in the comments below. Let me know what you guys think about the ban list. Um, again with uh, again Disc Commander and Straddles being bagged. That's kind of funny. That's pretty funny. Seeing the fact that they were banned for so many years. So, let, again, let me know what you guys think. And don't forget to smash that thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on the post notification bell so you guys get notified whenever I post another video. And on that, this is the boy Nash here signing out.